producing coal from the large open cast mine at Stockton on New Zealand's west coast is a major operation at any time. During the recent emergency, coal for essential services was kept moving by men from His Majesty's ships Taupo and Lachlan, aided by army and civilian truck drivers. Transporting the coal was a greater problem than mining it. Distance, difficult country and roading meant a lot of handling. The army starts the coal moving using heavy trucks up to 14 tons. Simple routine for them. The three miles of road to the first bin is stage one in the 10 miles to the rail. The 14 ton load is easily dropped, providing there's space below, and the nine ton tip is as speedy as most smaller models. Equally speedy are the sailors below who dispose of it by endless belt, naval construction, into smaller lorries as fast as it comes. A small overhead bridge built by the ever-versatile Navy ends the second stage. Ropeway trucks are filled to begin a steep run down to the coast. Distance and bends make changes to other rope lines necessary. At the first changeover, trucks are released from the rope and use is made of the traditional strong arm and decisive thrust to bring them to a halt. The second man throws his away. A supporting arm was really unnecessary. Six hundred tons a day went down the endless ropes. The Navy, in 10 different locations, organized the production of 114,000 tons of coal and at Westport turned round three ships a week. Tied up near the collier is HMS Lachlan, a survey ship, whose officers and men shared production with HMS Taupo, mastering all the difficulties in keeping coal on the move. 